Hey, what's up everybody? How you doing? Welcome back to Carbo Gaming and another Diablo 4 video. Well, I have a good one for you today. The devs did us right. We have a huge new update and with it, we have a ton of XP in Nightmare Dungeons. But which one is the best one to run solo or in a group to get millions of XP? Well, today I'm going to break it down for you and show you which ones is the best. Let's go! Once again, thanks for watching everybody. Without further ado, let's get started. Before we do it, looking for cheap Diablo 4 gold items and more, head over to u4gm.com, use the code CARPO for 5% off. Now, I've done a lot of testing, solo and in groups, and by far, the best dungeons is pretty much anyone that you want to do, but do it the most efficient way. Now, Wujo gave us a list of all of the best dungeons to do breaking it out by time, the monsters, as well as giving it a rank. Now, all of this is going to be totally up to you. If you're playing solo, if you're doing it in a group, and how good your build is, and the best time that you can clear it. So it's kind of going to be very subjective up to you if you're solo or in a group. But I got you covered. I'm going to be leaving some information for you that's going to make this extremely, extremely, extremely fun and farmable and on top of all of that you're going to know exactly what you're going to do and save yourself a lot of time i'm going to leave a link down below so you can see all of the dungeon maps layouts of all of the dungeons in the game now that you have all of that information you might want to farm for uniques we now know that it can drop at least at tier 31. so if you want to get after uniques well you can actually do all of these things at the same time and within minutes and get yourself some amazing XP as well. So with all of this information that we have, which one is the best to farm for XP? Like I said, it's very subjective, but I broke it down. And to me, by far, if you wanna do some super fast farming, even if you solo or in a group, I'm gonna be heading over to Blind Burrows. Now, of course, you're gonna need yourself a Nightmare Sigil. You may not have one of these in your inventory your friends may not have it you might have something else you could always come down over here break them all down and craft yourself a sigil the sweet spot in my opinion will be tier 31. tier 31 you can get those ultra rare uniques to drop and the clear time is actually really fast solo or in a group of course it's going to be depending up to your bill so tier 31 that's the tier that we're looking for you can also do this on tier 21. It's gonna be a little bit lower XP. You won't be able to have a chance to farm for your uniques. But for me, tier 31 blind burrows by far the best way to farm and get that XP. Of course, you're gonna to have to complete the whole dungeon, right? And if you're doing it with a group, it's super fun, super fast. If not, you can do this solo as well. Blind Burrows will also give you a chance for the Doombringer and the Grandfather as well. You can also hit up Alderwood. Alderwood is really fast form, but to me, it's Blind Burrows. Blind Burrows, T31, you're not going to get yourself chances to get yourself a unique to drop. It's super fun, super fast, and you can get yourself 20 to 50 million XP, depending if you're rolling solo or in a group. But for right now, that's pretty much going to for the video. Links down below for everything that you saw so you can put together your list of the best way to farm for your gear. It's all subjective, but it's definitely a whole lot of fun since the update. Once again, thanks for watching everybody. And as always, I'll be seeing y'all in the next one. Later.